What's up guys? It's Min and Kelly, and today we're taking you to Mount Charleston, the eighth highest mountain in Nevada, and the highest mountain in Clark County. Mount Charleston is also part of the Spring Mountains National Recreation Area that spans over 316,000 acres. The Shoshone name for Mount Charleston is where the snow sits. So it makes sense that we saw that creepy little snowman. How you feeling, Camper Kelly? Good. I see that. Kelly's crushing this hike, guys. Me too. Met a little dog on the trail. <laughs> he was very nice. spot to have a siesta as our English friend was saying. What's up sweet thing? There's the cave over there. All right, guys, we made it. We're at the top. We'll show you the waterfall. We'll show you the cave people are going in. We'll probably go in there too. We're just taking a little break right now. Mm -hmm. Kelly did awesome. Kelly was killing this hike. My Florida butt. We have no mountains, inclines, or what you call it, uh, like change in elevation. So Minfon is not meant for hiking. I can't breathe up here, but that's okay. It was still really fun. What's up to Traveling Robert? Hi, Traveling Robert. We want to use your soundtrack. The peak of Mount Charleston is almost 12,000 feet. Most of the hikes start at over 6,000 feet. I hear something, I'm just immediately running away. Looks like someone might have made a little fire out here at one point. If you had to, you could go underneath there. For it's underneath there. Eh, it just stops. You sure? Yeah, but you could probably like get out of like yeah. That's cool. Take your picture from here. Because it looks really cool.
just a nice little bench made by nature. So if you guys have been watching, you know we always throw a little bit of food in our vlogs. To reward ourselves for that hike, we decided to get some pink box. This is the Doe Pro and the Purple Rain. The Doe Pro. Bah. Very cool. You can Ripped see it's apart. A, definitely a croissant because so of easily. the layers. All right, how's that taste? Is legit. Very good and soft. Cool. I didn't eat mine until later because I wanted some protein, but the purple rain was also really good and soft. After our hike, we also decided to drive around the area to check out the cool houses we saw. Most of you guys know that I'm in real estate. So I was curious and checked out the homes for sale in this area. Some of the smaller homes that I saw are actually in the $200,000 range. Some of the larger homes were from about three to $11 million. So it all depends where you wanna live, what your view is and what kind of house you're getting. Eighty-three percent of the people who live in this area are owners. There's only 17 percent renters here. Which I guess makes sense because the median age in this area is 53. The average home price is about $600,000. Just under. One of the really crazy things is how quickly the terrain changes while you're driving. Just within a couple minutes, you can go from snow-capped mountains to more desert-like areas. That's going to do it for this episode, guys, but we definitely appreciate you watching. If you like travel and food content, make sure you travel over to the subscribe, like, and notification button and hit them up. Thanks again for watching.